Hey guys, I am live with Jennifer Harrison of Genevieve Designs. And I have to tell you, I found Jen, gosh, years ago now, I found what she did and realized that Jennifer's doing something nobody else is doing. And even to this day, to no one is doing it. And now I, I have something Jen, speaking. Hold on. Gosh, years ago now, I found what she did and realized. Hold on. This is my fault. Nobody else is doing. And even to this. <laughs> got it. Sorry, y'all. Um, Cause I got too happy and got into this um, page too fast. Anyway, what she does is so different. And when you can understand what she is offering you in her classes and you realize what you can do with this in the future, you will jump on her classes. They will be gone and you will see a style of crafting that mixes my love for like technology and uh, repeat projects. Like if I want to make that one again down the line with any paper pad that I want to use. So I want to introduce you to Jen. She has a YouTube channel. She's going to tell you about her YouTube channel. And she only has about, let's see, she has four classes, but one is already sold out. So you guys need to jump in on her other three classes. And so without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, meet Jen. Hello, darling. Hey guys, how are you? <laughs> Everybody's excited to see you. I'm looking in the comment section and um, I I'm trying to see if there's any. Oh, here's a question. Um, oh, no, it's not a question. That's somebody saying what we're doing. I'm trying to see if there was a question I missed earlier. I thought there was, but it might have been in the other chat. But people in the other chat were already excited to talk to you. So let's get going. And if I see a question, I'll jump in for you. OK, great. Well, I can just tell you the last Maticon was so much fun. That was my very first time teaching anything like that in person and there is just something super special about meeting you guys and being in the same room with you guys that is just so it's not even explainable it is so special and so neat and i had so much fun so i am looking forward to this because i've got four new classes uh, four different classes of uh, new templates that's never been seen before won't be seen till after uh made so um i'm pretty excited <laughs> I'm excited. They're excited too. Yeah, it's a lot of it's it's a lot of work, but it's a lot of fun, and I can't wait. So, um, my YouTube channel, I I um I design and develop printable templates. So you buy the template, you print it out onto your own pattern paper, whichever pattern paper you want to use, and you make the um, mini albums any way you want. Because I try to design the mini albums to where you can take that same page and use it, you know, four or five different ways. So it's different every time. So um, you're going to be able to um, do that, not just make the thing that we're making in the class, but you're going to be able to go home and make a totally different album for a totally different purpose, um, which is cool about my template. So then I show you on my YouTube channel how to do that. So basically, that's mostly what I do on YouTube. <laughs> so I love it. <clears throat> you do. <laughs> I do. I love what you do. I think it's so different. I think it's like I can what I love is I can purchase one template. Let's say I have a party coming up and I want to give a gift for this specific event. I can purchase that one template, but then I can turn around and make it again in a different way, which is even better. And you show us how to do that. Yes, I do. I try to show you many, many, many ways to use uh, the templates, not just the one original way that I designed it, but the way you can alter it or change it or cut that tab off or whatever. You can make a whole album just out of one of the envelopes in the template. I mean, you, I did, don't that. Have to, you did that. <laughs> you don't have to use the whole template. You can just use bits and pieces of it. So, and I designed many different sizes and types and styles and the two, well, actually it's going to be three different templates really um, at Maticon. They're all different. Um, I'm pretty excited about them. It's it's a little, um, it's not the normal thing that you've seen um, in mini album making. I'm kind of doing something a little different, but it's it's awesome, and I think everybody's gonna love it. So, <laughs> well, tell us about you have um, four classes. Like I said, one is sold out. Your Friday class is sold out. Tell us about your Thursday class, which is the Shabby Christmas mini album. I have it right here. Do you want to see? Yes. Here oh, is God. the cover. Uh. <laughs> It's incredible. Yes, we can see it. Okay. I didn't know if you can see yeah. it. So if you can see the cover is a corrugated cardboard and we're going to be doing some gessoing and um, ripping and tearing and carrying on. Uh, but here's, uh, I'll just show you one page on the inside. That's what the inside looks like. Um, so it's going to have flips and stuff. Whoops. I got things falling out. But with this class, it's a two-parter. 
it's a four hour class. So it's two hours in the morning and two, wait, no, two hours in the afternoon and then two hours closer to evening. Mm -hmm. So there's a break in between, which is great because the last Metacon, my classes were three hours and we were tired. Everybody was tired. Everybody needed a break. So, um, so that one's a two hour, or I mean, I'm sorry, a four hour class. Um, and you'll get everything you need. Did you hear the jingle bell? Yes, I love it. <laughs> um, you get everything you need. And Maymay can tell you, I over give. <laughs> I, I buy too much for you guys, but it's perfectly worth it to me because you need everything to make that album. You just need all those little detailed bits and pieces. So you get everything you possibly need um, and for the class. Well, and except I you need to bring your tools. I want everybody to recognize that she said her classes are four hours this time. We heard you guys and we heard Jen. Jen was trying to teach her classes in three hours and God love her. She did the best she could. And, and everybody thinks she did a really good job, but we thought, you know what, where we have the space, we're going to do that. So now this class is a four hour class and that break is going to be huge for Jen as well as you guys. So just to let you know that. <laughs> yes. And my husband, my husband will be there helping. And he was a big hit last time too. My goodness. <laughs> they always are. I don't know what the deal is with our husband. <laughs> I don't know. But he's great. And you know, what's really silly is he's never made a mini album in his entire life, but he helped so many people that had never made a mini album before. He helped them keep up because we had to move fast, but in a pace where everybody still made what we made. Do you know what I mean? It wasn't yeah. like they didn't go home with the same thing that we made. So, and that reminds me, somebody will be getting the album that I'm making during the class because I make it right along with you. So we're going step by step. You can't mess up. I mean, I'm even giving you the foam applicator brush thingy to, for the gesso. So, <laughs> I mean, you get everything. So you're going to walk away with um, something like this. So, it's pretty I'm pretty excited. Oh, and you also get to meet my daughter-in-law. She's coming to help too. Oh, yay. Yeah, that'll be fun. That will be fun. I'm excited about that. Well, me too. <laughs> um, but yeah, so the mini album class uh, is a two-parter. Then um, the Friday class, she says sold out, but that, that's also a two-parter. That is the top secret number one. Is that Friday? Yes. Oh, but Friday before that, Friday morning is the art journal, the DIY art journal. And I have that here. So it looks like this. Um, this is only going to be available at this class. So um, that's my artwork there on the cover. So it's like a little folder. And then there's like a little palette of actual watercolor paints on there. Oh, that's cool. It is. And it's the um, Daniel Smith, um, the ones that are made from the gemstones. So it's sparkly. I figured oh, that. Wow. If we're going to do some watercolor, we're going to sparkle it up. <laughs> so it's pretty cool. And then there's even like a little mixing area at the bottom there so that you can mix the colors together. Um, and then you also get a, a water brush. And we're going to make a sweet little watercolor uh, art journal. So we're going to be doing that in the class. And it's a two hour class. And then if we have time, we're going to do, I'm going to show you some techniques, um, some simple, easy techniques. For watercoloring so that will be fun that'll be it that'll be an easy beginner you know kind of class so that'll be fun that's awesome that one is nine o'clock friday morning so grab that class don't let them get gone yes this is true um <laughs> and then <laughs> this is true you need it's, that true. Class. it's true uh, but then the top secret number one is sold out oh i also wanted to mention um that i had people at Medicon last time that never made a mini album before ever and they made a mini album so i try to make it as easy and as you know painless <laughs> as possible um it's a lot of fun and the way i set things up and the way i set my templates up anybody can make them their first time around so if you're new and you've never made one don't be scared <laughs> Because it's easy. <laughs> it is, especially the way you're doing the class, because you're going to be making one with them and they're going to be able to go step by step. And so anyone can do this. Don't think you can't sign up for it. You'll be happy you did. That's right. That's right. That's that's what I try to tell people all the time is that it's intimidating when you think about it, but it's not. I think we overthink things. And so uh, don't overthink it. Just take my class. <laughs> yeah. Tell them about, okay, on Friday, the class that sold out on Friday, you also have a second one of it on Saturday. Well, it's not the same. Oh, explain that to us. 
None of my classes are the same. So the top secret number one, I can't tell you anything about it because it's such a new thing for me. I don't want, I don't want somebody to take it. <laughs> it's a cool idea. Um, so there's different sizes, I guess, is the best way. And the only thing I could probably say about it. So the top secret number one is um, bigger. It's a bigger thing, but I, I'm going to call it a thing. Yeah. <laughs> and then top secret number two is a smaller version of the thing. <laughs> is that okay to say that? It <laughs> is okay to say. What you can say is that you are designing this yes. thing. <laughs> Thing. And they will, um, they will be the first ones to see the thing. That period. Yes. I was going to try to have it out before made a con, but it's not happening. It's, it's just not happening. <laughs> so it's not going to be coming out until after made a con. So I'm sorry for those of you guys that have been waiting for it, but I, they, I just want it to be perfect. And so there's a lot to it. There's going to be a lot of new like build embellishments and that kind of thing that'll be included in each one of these classes, except for the art journal one, probably. But there's going to be a new, a lot of new things coming out and you guys are going to be the first one to have access to them. So, and let's be fair to say this, the thing is usable for everyone. Yes, absolutely. That's a fair statement. Mm -hmm. Anyone and everyone uh, could but, find a use for this. <laughs> and yes. like, at least I think you're going to like it. Well, the reason I say that is because I don't want somebody to go, oh, what if I take this class and it's something that I can't use or can't uh -huh. ever share? It's not. It's absolutely, it's either something you can use or something you can gift. That's right. And absolutely. May, 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 she's in the know and she's been sworn. But I'm not it. saying a word. Y'all will have to drag me out and try to, you won't hear it from me. But you know they're going to like it though, don't you? Yes, I do. <laughs> I will tell you, you'll be sad if you think, oh, it's top secret. I don't want to do it because then whenever you see the thing, that's right. <laughs> that's right. you'll be like, darn it. <laughs> should have checked in that class. <laughs> but the top secret number two has still got some spots available. And it's just, it's a smaller version. I think it's only a two hour class. Yeah. And it's only a two hour class. So it's just a smaller version. And we're going to, the way this is going to be, there's going to be so many different ways to use this new thing. <laughs> so the top secret number two is just going to be one of those ways. So I'm excited. Can we should stop because we're going to mess up. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Quit it. We've done enough. We're going to move on. Just know you want to take the class. Yes. I am so excited about it. <laughs> going to be great. Um, tell them a little bit about, um, how do we say like, how will they take the knowledge they get in your class and go home with it? Well, last time um, at MadeCon, I actually, well, I don't know what you mean. I actually made it, I made it, <laughs> I got MadeCon on the brain. <laughs> um, everybody got a USB last time and it had the templates and stuff on there. Well, they were really expensive. And in order to cut down on the cost a little bit, I decided not to do that this time. But what I'm going to do, I think, I was going to give you a code. But for 80% off on the templates that you, you know, purchased in the class. But I think what I'm going to do is just have you contact me and I will either refund your money or set it up special for the people that took my class. So, so basically, when you take her class and you use the templates, you'll be able to go home and get that again. So you won't just make what you make in her class, but you can take it home and do it again, what you've learned. That's right. That's so right. To tell you the value, like another thing that's real important. Sometimes people look at the cost of a class and go, oh, that's an expensive class. But if you break down the items that you're getting in this class, not just the knowledge, the, the things you're, I mean, you saw the album that she held up. You're literally going to be able to, if you want to mimic that, you can mimic it. Or if you want to change it, you can change it. So I don't want the cost of a class to ever hinder you. And like I said, we try to keep costs down. And this one is one of those classes. Trust me, you there could be a lot more added to this class. And she has done a great job at the price for the knowledge and for the, all the supplies you're going to get. Yeah. And you're going to get a lot, <laughs> which is good. I mean, the, the mini album class, you're, you know, the, the page that I showed you and there's eight of those and they, they're already going to be printed out for you. So it's not like you're going to have to be like, Oh, I'm going to have to go home and print these out to finish that album. No, you're going to have them with you in your hands. <laughs> You know, Michelle that works with us last year took your class. And the thing she said that was so cool is she said, not only did I have the stuff to make my project, I had a lot of stuff mm -hmm. that I could continue using. So that was really cool too. 
Yeah, yeah. I mean, because what's the point of just giving you one sheet of this and one sheet of that, and then that's all you've got? You know, that's I don't like that. So I want you to have as much as you possibly can without breaking the bank. <laughs> well, I'm going to tell you, people in the comments are saying, like Jessica Hernandez, who was there last time. Mm -hmm. I, I'm like you want to say last year, but it wasn't last year. It was this year. So well, yeah. <laughs> she was there last time, and she says Jen's class is so definitely worth every cent. Oh yay! I'm so happy. <laughs> we have some new folks coming to uh, Made It Con too, and I think they're going to have a good time in there. I'm looking to see. Um, Linda Cook says Jen's class is worth every penny. Oh, sweet. Thank they, you. All these guys know. So go ahead and grab. Somebody says, good question. Did I miss a question, y'all? I'm looking for my admins to throw questions up for me if I miss them. But what? Oh, someone wants to know this is an interesting question. Are you, what's your background? She says, is she an artist? Uh, yeah. Well, yes. I uh, started, I learned how to paint. I taught myself how to paint uh, with acrylic when I was 12. So there's my background um, in the art world. It's all, all on me. I didn't go to school for it. I didn't take classes for it or anything. And then um, I got married and then I did nails. So that's kind of an art form too. I did nails for 18 years and I actually developed like a, my hands became allergic to the acrylic. So I worked like that for like a year, all bandaged up. And then I found YouTube and I was watching um, people on YouTube and I thought I, I could make those. So I, that's kind of how it all started. So I really have no formal training in anything. <laughs> I'm a self-taught kind of person. I knew so, you were a beauty girl. I could tell by looking at you. Oh, oh really? <laughs> yeah. I was a cosmetologist for 15 years. I was oh, like, are you? Yeah, I did hear. <laughs> Maybe we'll say, you know, people in the beauty industry, they're artists in their own way. You know, you have to be, have some sort of artist, creative, you know, part of you in order to do hair, in order to do nails. So nails really are too, because not so much just the nail art portion of it, but nails, that really is an art and you have to get a feel for the chemical and the amount that you, it really is. a. That's why I never could do it. And I actually taught myself how to do nails too. And then I had to go to nail school to get my license, <laughs> but I taught myself how to do nails too. So I don't know. That's just the way I am. <laughs> the question Misty asked was, is there a way they can prepare for the top secret class? Um, no, just come excited and just come ready to create something that I think is awesome. <laughs> you really don't need, um, she's going to have everything for you. That's the other thing I love. It's like, you literally could never have crafted before. Mm -hmm. You need your make it kit. You do need your make it kit. That's in, somebody was asking earlier where they can find that. Um, I'm gonna get the guys to link it in the comments real quick, but it's on our page, which is linked in the description below. Um, Jen, Jen's classes are linked in the description below as well as the links to the Made It Con information. So all that's in there for you. And what the Made It Kit does, it's basically a kit that we ask you guys to bring that you pretty much use in every class that you go to. So it's like, it's simple supplies. It's nothing big. We don't have to have any fancy punch boards or anything like that. It's just simple things you probably already have. And then if you don't have it and you still want to attend, typically we have borrow things or things we can get that worked out for you. So if that's a problem, just let us know and we'll do our best to make that work for you. Mm -hmm. And um, I do have a few tools that you have to have though. You don't have to have them. You can borrow other people's, but the uh, crocodile, you need to bring one of those and you need to bring a regular hole punch, regular office hole punch. Super easy. That's listed in the description of the classes. Anything you do have to bring is listed in those descriptions. Okay, I think, I hope, I'm, I need to double check. If it's not, we'll make sure it is, so. You know, something else that my, all of my students get when they um, come to my class is they get a bag. Do you remember the bag I made for the last Metacon? Yes. It's, it's a custom bag with my stuff on it. So their um, kit actually comes inside that bag. So I'm making a new one for this Metacon. Cool. And Somebody asked, what about ink colors? Brenda asked. Oh, I'm going to be using walnut stain. Um, oh, I can't reach it. <laughs> I'm going to be using walnut stain distressed oxide, I think. And the there is a list on your um, webs on your classes. But if there's anything else we need to add, we can look at it and make sure. But there is a right. list. The specific color, I don't think I said before. But that's what I'm going to use. And Jessica says, everyone in classes are so generous and share. And that's true. That's one thing about crafters. We share. Yes. <laughs> and they did. They really did. Because there was a few things that people didn't have. And because some people were so new that they didn't have every little bits and pieces. But then everybody's like, here. And they, you know, threw them across the table. <laughs> well, we share because we want to get them hooked on those tools because they we want them to be like us. 
Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Tool nerds. You know, you have every tool. <laughs> you need to love this as much as I do. Try it. <laughs> exactly. That's how I feel. <laughs> I do too. You have, if I'm hooked, you have to be hooked. Yes, that's right. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, if you have any cl any questions for Jen, ask them in the comments real quick. And um, I, your her classes are going to sell out. I'm going to tell you ahead of time. They're going to sell out. You got to go grab a class. The link is below. Um, one thing that I've been told to remind you on my little notes, because Amanda makes me notes. If y'all don't know, my assistant's so good. She makes me notes. So she says, I need to remind you guys about our Facebook page. And this is really important. So I'm going to take just a second. If you sign up for any Made It Con classes, we have a private Facebook page for students who are attending. The reason for that, this is a, gr a page or a group on Facebook that we use while we're actually in Pigeon Forge or whatever location we're at so that we can say, hey guys, we're all going to go to lunch here. We're all going to go shopping here if you want to join us. But we don't want that to be public because we're at a location and that's just for the people who are attending. So in order for you to join that group, you will have had to have purchased a ticket to one of the classes. Okay. So that group's available. If you have bought a ticket and not requested to join the group, I want you to send an email to Amanda at May May Made It. And that way she can get you hooked up on that um, Facebook site. And if you already know about the Facebook site, you can just head over there and you've bought your ticket. You can request to join and we'll get you signed up. And that way, anything that's going on at Made It Con, you're going to be there. Anything that's going on you need to know is listed there. Not we already tell you guys everything else if you're not on Facebook, but pretty much everything you need to know is listed there. Um, I think that's all the things I had was listed to remind of. Here's a question. Eve says, when you say crocodile, which one do you mean? There are several, right? I don't think so. Isn't there just one? There's just different color handles, isn't there? Well, oh, what about the we, big call, we call them all crocodiles, but the one that Jen is referring that she showed in her hand just there is the one that is the hole punch eyelet setter. Not this one. Not the big, huge one. Uh, that's the bike. Right? I think that's called the bike. I can't remember. But she's talking about the one that is the eyelet setter on one end and has hole punches on the other, on the little sides. That's the crocodile. Um, so not a corner rounder or a corner chomper. This is a crocodile. Yeah, what does it say? Does it say here? I don't think so. No, I don't think so. The only reason I know is because we sell them on our website and I know the title that they put on them and it's it's confusing. It's the weird one. It's like the, looks medieval. I think it's called eyelet setter slash hole punch. And one of the girls can link it here to make sure, because we do have it in the store and then we can um, get the title that way too. Um, Julie Wascom wants to know, Meme, will Jen be doing a video on her Christmas album on YouTube after Made It Con? Oh, yeah. I, well, I don't know if it'll be. Yeah, probably. I don't know why I just said, I don't know. Yeah, I will. But it'll be later. Like right now I'm showing videos from, the last made a con they're just now seeing the albums that now right here too those are the two we made at last made a con so we're just now seeing those on youtube even though i filmed them before made a con <laughs> but yeah eventually it all gets out there and the thing um the thing about this is and i i feel like jen's this way too whenever we have a class that we sell to a group of people i like for it to be a little bit exclusive i think that's only fair because we're you know, they're charging to come in there. It's kind of not fair for me to charge these people this money and then turn around and do it right again on YouTube. Okay. I'm not going to tell you that my classes and the things I do won't eventually show up on my YouTube channel, but I won't mimic exactly what I did and what you get in classes a little, uh, first off, it's hands on and it's a little more um, exclusive. I don't like exclusivity, but I feel like you got to have some value. Right. Cause it's special. I mean, people are coming from far away and they're flying and they're making the effort to come spend time with me. So I wanted to be special for them as well. So I agree with you on that. I don't like exclusive either, but it's special, you know? It is. And it's it's the least we can do. I mean, we have we literally have people who fly in from all over the country. Um, last Made It Con, we had folks from Canada. I'm trying to think what other countries we had them from. And, it, and it's just important that we make it feel worth, you know, worth the dollar they spend. And so we don't want to just turn around and go, well, you don't really have to go. You can get it on YouTube. Although I will tell you, most of the stuff we do will end up on YouTube at some point, just maybe not as a here you go class. Not instant. Yeah, I agree. Um, Eva's asking if there's a playlist of teacher focused videos. There's not, but that's brilliant. I'll do that after this is over. Let me make myself a note. And um, Canada's coming again. Yay. Oh, hey. <laughs> on our cruise, I didn't tell you this, Jen. On our cruise, we had somebody from the UK. Well, actually, oh, we had people from the UK. Yep. 
That's so cool. That's make so cool. myself a list for a playlist. And then there's another question. Will we ever do one in the DC area? Actually, we're looking to do um, one in the next year to two years, kind of up the coast a little bit. So it'll probably be closer. Um, I don't really know. We look at the big map and we go, hey, if we go here, all these people can come here. You know, that's kind of how we do it. So our next ones are going to be up in places. <laughs> And Anita Ware says, that is only fair, talking about how we do our classes, and she agrees with us, and we appreciate that. Yeah, it's it's a big deal that they're taking the time out of their life to come see us and to see what we do, and I respect that, and I, I appreciate that. So, It's amazing how much money that they will spend, and they, I mean, honestly, we know, and we appreciate it, and so we want to give you all the value that we can. That's right, and, and you know what, even if you can't take my class, there's free stuff too. Isn't there like the meet and greet? You yep. know, if you don't get to take my class, come to the meet and greet and meet me there. Uh, At the meet and greet. By the way, I'm glad you mentioned it because we haven't really talked about it much, but the meet and greet is done on Saturday afternoon. And I'll let the girls tell me the time because I do not know the time exactly, but that's a free event. Anytime we do a made it con, we have at least one free event. So you can come and meet all the teachers and just hang out with us. It's like a, it's like a big hangout. We'll have snacks and refreshments. And the other thing we're doing at this meet and greet is every teacher's table will have a giveaway. So every person that's there is going to be doing some kind of giveaway drawing that we will give away that day while you're there. So it makes it worth it. Like you can come for free and enter that giveaway. And the event's like a two hour event. So you don't have to hang out forever. And then we'll give away the um, prizes right then and there. So that's another thing. We just, we just want to make it where you guys, if you can't come to the whole thing, at least come to the meet and greet and you'll be like, it was wow. That's what we want it to be. <laughs> Well. Are you right. are we uh, providing something cool for that? Do you do you know? Is who said that? I, I talked over you. Oh, sorry. <laughs> are we providing something cool for that? Uh, for the giveaway for the meet and greet? Um, maybe I'll I'll message you. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> maybe I'll, I say I'll message you. That always means Amanda will message you. Right. <laughs> Um, is, is this is my favorite? Is Michelle still playing in May May House? Yes, Michelle is still playing in May May House. She's actually in the chat today. Michelle is in Texas and she is trying to get the last bits of her stuff settled. And we're not exactly sure if that what exactly that means today, but it's it's a hard thing to pick your life up and travel across country and start over. So uh, Michelle is. As a matter of fact, just to say this real quick, Michelle is doing our uh, chalk couture side of things. And you probably think I don't do chalk couture because I haven't done a single video on it, but I do it and it's super fun. And so um, that is what Michelle's doing right now. And I think, and I hate to say this if I'm wrong, but I think Michelle's going to be at Decorators Warehouse. She can let us know in the comment section, but I think she's going to be able to be there with us um, in two weeks. All right. There she is. Michelle said, I love playing in May May House. <laughs> I want to come play. Uh, you should come down here. It would be fun. I do. I want to play. <laughs> when I say down here, uh, Jen is from Kentucky and we should drag her down to Alabama. She might not go back. We're, we're kind of, our <laughs> lives are pretty similar though. Cause she's a Southern girl. We can say that. We can yep. Say that. Yep. <laughs> uh, Leslie Benites. And I pr probably said that one wrong says, Mamie and Jen, you guys inspire me so much. Thank you for it. Oh, that's yeah. what my goal is. <laughs> That's exactly right. All right, guys, I think we're going to call this one. I think we've answered all the questions that we can. Also, Amanda wanted me to remind you here in the chat that the lives that we've done are connected to the teacher's pages. So if you go back and look at each teacher, you can watch the live and see their demos right there on their product page that is in the description of their video or go to maymaymadeit.com. And in the middle of the page, it says events hover over events and it'll drop down and you can click on made it con or made it con teachers. All your information is right there. What does it say? Oh wait, there's a hold on. I'm missing something. Linda says, uh, someone said, I agree with Linda. That's why I ask about paying for classes online at a later date. It's a little, <laughs> I'm going to see if Jen agrees with me about this. So my in, in person classes, there's no way to recreate that on a video. Like, I could do the project for you, but probably I've done the project already in some way on my channel. But in-person classes are different. Do you agree? I do. I agree 100%. They're very special. That's the only way I can think to describe them. It's so. like I could I could even put a camera in the room and show you every step of it. It would not be the same. Right. It's just not. It's so the energy is different. Everything's different. There is so. an energy in the room. There is a camaraderie. Um, and more than likely, and honestly, what I'm teaching at MadeItCon, I've taught before 
on my channel for free. But it's something about being together that we really like to do. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it was a good time. I really enjoyed it or I wouldn't be back. <laughs> See, so. I'm not dragging her. She enjoyed it. <laughs> Right. She's not forcing me. I'm not opposed to dragging her though, because I love her. I would drag her. <laughs> Everyone saying thank you. They agree with us. And uh, let's see. We're so glad to see my and Jen working together. We love you both. That's sweet. Thank you, Louise. That is sweet. All right, guys, we're going to sign out. We love you very much. If you want to get any of the classes, go check them out. If you have any questions, you can get us at info at maymaymadeit.com and we can answer anything we can. If it's a question for Jen and we need to forward it, we'll be happy to do that. Thank you, guys. Bye. 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 <laughs>